Hello, this is Adrian from White Hat Automation. I'm going to show you the sentence spin feature of SpinAchieve 3 and just to give you an idea of the sort of thing it can do. So I've got SpinAchieve open and I'm going to paste in a paragraph that I wrote. Now this sentence, this paragraph is a little bit convoluted. I did write it myself, it's not something I've lifted off a website but I, I wanted to keep it short so that we don't have to ski, keep scanning through a long article to find the bits that it's changed. If I keep it short like this it's a lot easier to see. I just want to show you the kind of thing that the sentence spin can do. So we've got this paragraph, short paragraph here. The boy ate the apple, the boys ate the oranges quickly, they were juicy and sweet. The boys and girls are going to the restaurant tomorrow, they will eat fish, the girls love the boys. So if we go into the sentence spin feature and just spin it to the spin tax format, the boy ate the apple. That's changed to the apple was eaten by the boy. Now that's very clever. It's, it's taken the object of the original sentence and made it the subject. The boys ate the oranges quickly. That goes changes to the boys quickly ate the oranges. So that's taken the um, adverb and placed it in a different place in the sentence. They were juicy and sweet. It's changed to, they were sweet and juicy. That's taken those two adjectives and swapped them around. It means exactly the same thing, but of course, it will count as unique content. The boys and girls are going to the restaurant tomorrow. Tomorrow, the boys and girls are going to the restaurant. So it's taken the, the time factor of the sentence and taken it from the end and put it at the beginning. It means exactly the same thing, but it looks it will be unique content. They'll eat fish. It's changed to, they shall eat fish. The girls love the boys, of course they do, and that's changed to the boys are loved by the girls. That's another example of the object of the sentence being changed into the subject. So let's go ahead and just spin that and see if we get the uh, we can we can read the article properly. Then just go ahead and spin it, and there it is. The apple was eaten by the boy. The boys quickly ate the oranges. They were sweet and juicy. Tomorrow the boys and girls are going to the restaurant. They shall eat fish. The boys are loved by the girls. Now that's good, but here's the really clever part. All of our rules, our sentence spinning rules, are reciprocal. So we should be able to take that, I've just copied that, and put it back into Spinner Chief, and let's see if it can recognise the uh, sentence, the paragraph, and spin it back to the original so that's what we've just spun. The apple was eaten by the boy, etc. Now let's take the sentence spin feature. Spin to the spin tax format, which it's done. And let's see if we've got it. Um, it has certainly spun each phrase. If we go into the spin dialog and actually spin it, we can just read it. And let's see if we're back to the original. The boy ate the apple. The boys ate the oranges quickly, they were juicy and sweet. The boys and girls are going to the restaurant tomorrow, they will eat fish. The girls love the boys. So it's doing some really complicated stuff there. Look, it's taken something like the boys are loved by the girls and changed that back to the girls love the boys. There's a lot of number crunching going on there to do that. Um, and it's very clever and it's obviously it's going to help you to write human readable content that is unique in your articles when you're spinning now, I'm not saying that you can take an article and completely write it, rewrite it by using the sentence spin function. What I'm saying is it's it's a very powerful feature that you can use in conjunction with other features in SpinAchieve to get unique content that's human readable just by the click of a button. That's an idea of what the sentence spin feature does. I hope you enjoy using it and we'll be back with more soon. Bye now.